any legislative body may decide on the basis of overwhelming evidence of fraud to send electors to the Electoral College who accurately reflect, reflect the president's legitimate victory in their state. That was before the presidential race had even been called for Biden. People had voted, but the race had not even been called. It was actually two full days later, November 7, 2020, when the numbers and the nonpartisan outlets called Biden defeats Trump for White House. That timeline hurts the Trump defense that we've heard so much about, that these individuals pushing these plots were acting in a good faith belief they had won. Regardless of the results that were not even in, he was already pushing this plot. 